When people is asking me, Stefano, what do you think is luxury today? I would say is luxury everything that gives an emotion. My passion is really making my own cloth for suits, for shirts, for ties, for sportswear. And a combination of different material leather and cashmere or just playing with the silk and the cotton it is a continuous evolution but what makes the difference is the finishing is the touch and is the detail of what you're doing you have to feel the passion of the tailor that is physically stitching the cloth Once you enter in a company like Stefano Ricci, founded 40 years ago, uh, it was a big challenge because I wanted to find my own space and uh, to figure out what I could give to the company, something more to help my family to build the business. And it has been the same for my brother. So uh, he entered, he found his niche, which was uh, the home collection. Everything, of course, came out from the, the, the passion and the inspiration of the designs that my father has been uh, doing for the past 40, almost 40 years. And starting from that, we started in for a product 100% in Florence again, also starting from porcelain, going up to the silverware cutlery, and now also into the crystalware. Everything started from a deep research into our archives to find some uh, designs that really recognize Stefano Ricci, the Stefano Ricci world and the Stefano Ricci theme in all our collections and trans transmit it into, for example, a plate. But with, uh, the, of course, uh, using very uh, fine materials, using gold, platinum, and apply, of course, our creativity on it, we made it a little magic. The, the guideline for all, this for all these uh, markets is quality and exclusivity. That is gui the guideline that helps my father, my brother, the whole team to give every season a new collection that gives emotion. Because we address our collection to people that have everything, that they can afford everything. What they really look for is an emotion. For example, we, many years ago, I was uh, after the opening of the Beverly Hills Boutique uh, in uh, 2001, I remember a gentleman that walked in, he looked around, he saw the place, and his sentence was, I always remember, this is the place where I have to spend my money, which means we gave him an emotion. Well, these days, I must say, it's always been, of course, the whole preparation of the Stefano Ricci fashion show in Moscow, which has been our first Stefano Ricci, first freestanding Stefano Ricci show in the world, and of course in Russia. And, uh, been a very intense uh, three and a half months of preparation, but the result uh, looks really, really nice. We're very honored and very happy about how it came out, and uh, the whole result, uh, well, you'll see it on video.